Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. Guys, today I am going to introduce you to a new mobile application called Picture This. Another application is Plant Snap. You can use both of these applications for identifying plant species using your mobile camera. Just take a picture of the plant, of the flower, of its leaves or the fruit. It will search on the internet and identify your plant. Your Wi-Fi must be connected. You can find these applications on Play Store. Just go to Play Store, search for Picture This or Plant Snap. Both of these applications can work. Download them, install them and then it will ask for some permissions. Allow them to use your camera and then you will be able to use these applications. Guys, I have a chart on my wall which contains pictures of different plants. Let's see if it can identify different plants from that chart or not. So click on the picture this, it will be opened in a moment and then you can see three buttons. The first button is tick photo, the second is photo album and the third button is plant care. You need to click on tick photo. So click on tick photo. Okay, now your mobile camera will be opened and you can see a chart, vegetables chart. Let's focus one of the plant, for example corn. And let's take the picture and see. Yeah, Zia maze. It has correctly identified this Zia maze. Now let's identify this plant. Tomato. That's great. Okay, now you can press either the back button on the bottom right, an arrow button to go back, or you can press the top right camera button to go to the camera again. So just click on this top right camera button, your camera will be open. Now let's focus this potato and see if it can identify this potato or not. Yeah, it has identified potato. Okay, now let's focus this ginger. Ginger, identified. Okay, now let's focus this mint plant. Click on this green button. American corn mint, spear mint, etc. Click on the camera button again. Let's see if we can identify this plant, bangan. Eggplant, well, well done. Click on the camera button again. Okay, now let's take the picture of red radish and see if it can identify wild radish. Now let's as a negative control and just for fun take a picture of a car and see if it can consider it as a plant or not. For example, this is a van. Take the picture. So this I am using as a negative control and it says, oops, I couldn't find plants in the picture. So the negative control is confirmed. Okay, let's take the picture of these onions. So identified onion. Try this sweet potato. Identified sweet potato. So I would not suggest to use this application for research work because in research work we need more accuracy. But common people can use this application just for fun or just for their knowledge. So this application can help you almost, uh, I think, 90% correct prediction of a plant. You can take the pictures of real plants, the flowers, the leaves, the fruits, and then see the results. I would suggest that you should take multiple pictures and identify the flower, the leaves, the whole plant, and as well as the fruit. So then you will reach to a conclusion about that plant's species. This application will be very useful for the students of botany. So this is a very good application. I would suggest you to download the application and use it. And inshallah I will search other useful applications on Google Play Store and will let you know as soon as I find any other interesting application on the Google Play Store. So thank you for watching my video but don't forget to subscribe me because I am going to bring you very informative and educational content as well as fun content to my YouTube channel. 
Bye.